More than seven hours they spent. We saw them coming and going from this home up and down these steps, the same steps that Holt walked down when he surrendered to authorities. Take a look at the video. You'll see the FBI evidence team here on Ladora Way in Hazelwood gathering evidence. They were waiting for a time for warrants, then spent hours executing them. Uh, we believe one of the things they may have been looking for was the weapon used to kill Officer Shaw. Neighbors here who were watching those comings and goings were awakened early this morning by the sound of authorities coming to get Holt. They described for us what they saw, what they heard, and what they felt in those moments. Oh, Jesus, the cop killer's on my street. That's what was going through my mind. They were telling them, get back in your house, get back in your house. They're running through the backyards. I'm not used to stuff but being like that on the street, in this quiet street. He came off the porch. He told him to lift up his shirt and walk down the steps. He lifted up his shirt, walked down the steps, and he told him to Okay, you're down the steps, lock your hands behind your head. He did that. They pulled him over to the side of the SWAT truck. One resident told us that he had gotten out his own weapon inside his home, prepared in case there would be a home invasion on the part of anyone trying to get away from police. Reporting live in Hazelwood, Bob Mayo, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.